checking the oil level on a BMW 7 Series with an N63 or an N63T engine. I just want to note that uh, BMW has actually increased the oil capacity on this particular engine, which is the 8-cylinder turbo engine. BMW's designation is the N63 and N63T. Uh, they basically state that uh, on while the normal oil consumption used to be one quart per 750 miles, they've actually changed that for turbocharged engines to one quart for every thousand miles. And they've increased the oil capacity by one quart. So to check your oil level, you would go under vehicle info. vehicle status, and then measure engine oil, and then engine oil level. So let's measure engine oil. Alright, the vehicle must not be at operating temperature yet. Let's check this one here, engine oil level. Let's just have to wait for this vehicle to get the operating temp. Basically, they're saying that uh, with any turbocharged engine, topping off of the engine oil might be more frequent. This is going to be applicable for FO1s, FO2s, 7 Series, FO6, FO7, the F10, F12, F13, and E70 and E71 X5. So any vehicle that has the N63 or the N63T, when it, ask, when it actually tells you to add one quart, you need to add two quarts. Now that's not going to be on the S engine, like on the M5. It's only going to be on the N engine. And the total capacity is 9.5 quarts. Uh, this also doesn't apply to any active hybrid. So if you have a 750 Active Hybrid, 750LI, or an E72X6 Active Hybrid, then you would not add the extra quart of oil. Still waiting for this to catch up to me here. Alright, now that the vehicle is up to temperature, I'm going to start the measurement. It's going to go through the full measurement. And what I expect to see is that it's going to basically state to add one quart, which is from the bottom to the top. Now, since this is an N63T engine, I'm going to go ahead and add two quarts. And when it updates, it's actually not going to read overfilled. It's going to read the fill, full level, and then basically what happens is that you can make it pretty much to your next oil service in most cases, or um, you know cut your top off requirement in half. The oil pan is actually larger, so it allows for the extra quart of oil. there. Yep, it's actually showing red. Below minimum, please add one quart of engine oil as soon as possible. So when you see a message like this when it says to add one quart and you have the N63 or N63T engine, which is the eight cylinder with the turbo engine, then you need to go ahead and add two quarts. What's interesting is that this message pops up at one quart of oil as soon as possible. Now if you added one quart of oil you're going to end up showing that it's full. But in order to reduce the amount of time that you're going to see this message you can actually add the two quarts. And that's basically what BMW is allowing. So whenever you come in for an oil change you're going to actually get the 9.5 quarts instead of being only 8.5 quarts. So your top ups will be less. It'll be interesting to see if they actually change this 
message eventually to actually state to add two courts instead of one court in the future. If you want to top up your oil, you're going to use this right here, and then this is where you're going to add your oil. Went ahead and added two quarts. On the selection. Vehicle info. And to the right here. There we go. Engine oil. Start measurement. So this is going to be the measurement after adding two quarts instead of the recommended one quart. Again, this is on the twin turbo N63 and N63T. Definitely an amazing vehicle to drive. I have seen some injectors fail. I've actually have seen about two engine replacements due to a leaking injector causing a hydro lock and a vent connecting rod. But that is pretty uncommon now. BMW actually has some updated injectors that uh, are designated with a little square on the injector. And uh, we haven't been seeing as much problems with the new injectors. shouldn't read overfilled, it reads max, and that was with two quarts, and the recommendation for the iDrive was to add one quart. So realistically, if you have the N63, two quarts, and uh, then uh, hopefully you can make it until the next oil service without having to come in for a top-up or adding additional oil. You know, with the turbocharger system, uh, you're always going to be using oil, and it is it is a common thing, it's not a defect with the vehicle.